Here's another problem dealing with counting. From the 10 books that you've recently bought but not read, you plan to take four with you on vacation. How many different sets of four books can you take? In this problem, we have 10 from which we're going to choose four. But notice that the order in which we choose won't make a difference as to which four we end up bringing with us. So for that reason, we're going to say this is a combination. It's going to have 10 objects, and we're going to choose from that a combination of four. The formula we'll use will give us 10 factorial divided by 10 minus 4 factorial times 4 factorial. That's going to equal 10 factorial divided by 6 factorial times 4 factorial. Now we're going to write this out by starting off with 10 factorial and writing 10 times 9 times 8 times 7 times, and when I get to 6, I notice that if I just write it as 6 factorial, I'll have a common factor with my denominator. We'll leave the 6 factorial, and then we're going to take our 4 factorial and write it as 4 times 3 times 2 times 1. Notice that the 6 factorial will divide out, and now we can see other common factors. For instance, the 4 times 2 can divide out with the 8, and the 3 can divide into the 9 3 times. So now we're looking at 7 times 3, which would be 21, times 10, which will end up giving us 210. So there are going to be 210 different sets of books from which to choose.